In this video, I'll show you how to use Talk To base prompts. Base prompts in Talk To Apollo AI Assist is like setting rules for the AI. Imagine them as if-then rules. The if part tells the AI what to watch for in messages. Like if a user starts the chat by submitting their name and email address. The then part tells the AI what to do when it sees the if. It could be answering or saying something specific. For instance, if the user wants to order, ask them what product they're interested in. Or if they need billing support, tell them to contact billingexample.com. The first option asks AI to generate a response as per said rules, and the second one makes it send the quoted text. You can also make the AI send clickable buttons. Just put option before the text you want to see as a button. You can also use this base prompt to use buttons to transfer the chat to a human. When it comes to lead capture, it is possible to configure AI to operate with little to no data source info. It would just need to have clear instructions on how to ask qualifying questions. You can use this base prompt if the user is looking to purchase real estate and ask to confirm the location. Once the user confirms the location, ask to confirm the property type they are looking for. Once the user confirms the property type, ask about their budget range. Once you have the location, property type, and budget ask for user's contact method and the best email or phone number to contact them. Once the user has provided their contact information, you can use this prompt to thank them and advise them that one of your specialists will be in touch within a business day. Remember to turn on email notifications to get leads in your inbox when the AI finishes chatting. You can also use base prompts to correct the AI if it's behaving badly. Instead of saying, don't say you're an AI, Tell it what to say when asked about itself. For further instructions on how to use this function, please visit our community center or schedule a call with an AI Assist specialist by clicking the link in the description.